Hi, I'm Aubrey Mulock, one of the product marketing managers here at Red Hat, and I'm joined today by my peer Eunice. We wanted to kick off just by talking about what makes Red Hat a different and special place for us to work. I remember interviewing and the people who were trying to bring me in were trying to say, it's just, it's different. Like the culture is mm -hmm. different, the people are different. And then you interview and they're like, well, we're different because we're open source. Like, but it's hard to explain what that means. And to me, I think it means culture and community. You're not only embraced when you join Red Hat, but you have a group of peers who genuinely care about you and about your work. They want to know how your weekend was, how your vacation was, mm -hmm. if your dog's feeling better. You know, like those are just day-to-day -day components that yeah. are integrated into your job. Definitely, and I'll say for the open culture, just like you said, one of the things that I was told when I first joined is everybody knows everything. Yeah. <laughs> If you hear about somebody working on a specific project that usually appeals to you, you can just ask them and they'll give you all the files that yeah. we're working on. So yeah. I think that's a big plus. Yeah, the sharing for it. Yeah. And I guess that does go back to the open source community yep. piece too, right? Like yeah. people don't have to be here, they want to be here. And they are wanting to collaborate, they're wanting to communicate, they're wanting to contribute. And that's what makes it I agree. different. Selfishly for my AIML, which is where I work on open source communities, the future of AI ML. That's where all the innovation is being done. So being part of Red Hat, being on the largest open source company in the world is definitely the place to be, I think, if you yeah. want to be an AI ML. Definitely. All the new technology, all the mm -hmm. upcoming features. There's always somebody learning about the newest, latest, most interesting technologies and yeah. then trying to figure out how to apply it back to what we do on a day-to-day -day basis. Exactly.